Hello my friends, I hope you are doing well. In this video, I'm gonna talk about how a label maker can help you stay organized, especially as it relates to your planner. I wanna thank the Make ID company for sending me this label maker to do an honest review. Make sure you stay tuned to the end of this video because I will be doing a giveaway of a new label maker. At the time of this video, this label maker costs between $25 and $31, and that includes a roll of the white labeling tape. So when it comes to planners, the most common way people use label makers are for tab dividers. So if you want to make custom tab dividers in your planner, you can simply use a label maker to do that. The cool thing about this label maker is that you can make labels in different sizes. You can even put pictures and icons on the label and just use it to help you organize a lot of things. So one of the ways that I've been using this label maker, and I'm going to demonstrate how it works in a moment. I've been using this in my Clever Fox planner. This is an undated planner. With an undated planner, it might be helpful to have a label maker or even if you have a dated planner and you want to divide it into sections or put certain labels in your planner, a label maker is helpful. So as you can see here, I've been putting in the months in this weekly planner. I've been getting really creative with the washi tape here, but I've been really having a good time with using this label maker. I've been trying out different things with the label maker and I think it looks much better than me writing in the month on my planner pages. It's lightweight, it's easy to carry with you if you would like to do that, and it works through Bluetooth technology. So what you do is, I turned it on here, as you can see the green light is on, and I downloaded the Make ID app. So once it's on, I turn on the app and it says that the label maker is connected. So here you can either use an existing template, this one has a little icon there, but it gives you different ideas on the type of labels that you can print. And I really like the way it prints, I think the labels are very clear. So that's that's under the home tab then there's a life tab where you can make labels for different items as you can see here another common place that I use labels are on my file folders tax season is coming up so I'll definitely will be using the label maker to put a label on my different folders to organize my tax receipts so what I'm going to do is start with a blank slate I'm just going to hit the create a label and here you have an option where you can use a template those templates that I just showed you you can just start entering text you can put stickers so let me show you some of the stickers these are some of the icons that come with it. You can include this on your label or you can include a picture from your photos. So if I click here, for example, I have a picture of a Tiffany lamp that I like. I can add this to the label if I want. I think this will be a good option too. Like if you're a business owner and you want your logo to actually show on the labels, you can upload your logo and print that on the label. There's also an option called painting where you can do free form and you can upload this as well to your label. So for this example, I'm gonna keep it simple. This is my my business planner by the way if you have not seen my video on this and you own a business you really want to take a look at this planner because it's an excellent planner for business owners right here there is the name section where it says this planner belongs to I just want a label that says Tanya plans because I would prefer to have a label there because my handwriting isn't that great so what I'm going to do is just type a label here called Tanya plans when I'm done I hit the check mark next I hit print and it will show me a print preview of how it's going to look that's fine and then I'm gonna hit print and that quick the label came out the label printer is relatively quiet and to cut it I just press that button down and here is my label so on the back the label tape is split you can just easily peel the back off now see how clear that is the label maker comes with white tape but you can buy different color tapes on the website all of the items shown in this video will be linked in the description area under this video so if I wanted to I can trim this label down if I want it but I'm not I'm just going to place it in here and it looks like that I like how neat that looks another way I use label makers is in my journal I love keeping on a journal I've been doing so for years and I've shared this on Instagram there I posted a story of me actually creating this spread these are some photos that were taken on Christmas Day and here I use the label maker with the border to put Christmas 2021 in this journal spread I also use the label maker to make a label called what I got for Christmas 
I like to take pictures of what I receive for gifts for my birthday and for Christmas. It helps me remember what I got and it helps me look back and appreciate those times. And I think a label maker is a great thing to have for people who like to journal. Another way to use your label maker is to label cords. So if you look under your desk and there are a bunch of cords and you don't know which cord goes to what, you can use a label maker to put on each cord so it can identify which cord is for the printer, which cord is for the computer, and so on and so forth. Another way I plan to use this label maker is to label my chargers. In our house, we have a bunch of these charger bricks and the kids tend to take my charger bricks. So I plan to put a label on this that says mom, just so I can keep up with which brick came with which phone. Also, people use label makers to label light switches. You can also use a label maker to put your name and phone number on electronic devices. So if they're found, they can be returned to you. I think a label maker is especially helpful in households with children as well because then you could label the children's belongings. I've also seen people use label makers in the kitchen where maybe if you do canning where you can food to preserve it to be eaten later, you can use a label maker in your pantry to label food, to label spices, and so on and so forth. So there are a ton of household uses for the label maker. So this is the label maker that I'll be giving away. In the box, you will get the label maker, a roll of labeling tape, and you'll get the USB cord. So to enter the giveaway is easy. Just simply comment underneath this video how you plan to use the label maker if you want it. And again, if you just prefer to buy it, I'll have the link to the label maker underneath this video. This giveaway is open internationally and I will have the full rules and the deadline for entering in the description area. Please make sure you check back the area underneath this video to see if you've won. I've been doing a lot of giveaways lately on my channel and sometimes people are not responding to my messages when I say that they have one and I'm still holding their prizes, so make sure you check back to see if you want. If you have another use for a label maker that I didn't mention here, please let me know in the comments. The best ideas come from you in the comments, and I love talking to you guys. Please don't forget to like this video. This is Tanya, helping you feel more organized so this can be your best year yet. Take care.